Well, nowadays, many restaurants feel like they need to do more than just serve up a tasty meal. They need to turn dining into an experience. Well, a new restaurant in Royal Oak took that to the next level where every meal comes with a side of wow. Mm -hmm. Michelle Oliver takes us to dine in the D at Imaginate. As they say, you first eat with your eyes. And at Imaginate Restaurant in Royal Oak, their first impression can be pretty eye-catching. We like to say we put the fun into fine dining. We actually bring out their food, which is served with props. It brings laughter, it brings joy, and it also gets them to pull out their phone to do some Instagram. We're talking flashing lights, a giant sword, even a popcorn machine to serve their popcorn shrimp. We're trying to give you that Disney wow factor approach. I feel if you didn't come through the door and you didn't say, wow, this is amazing, or the place smells terrific, uh, then I don't think we did our part. And their chef's table takes all that creative energy up a notch. I was thinking very hard, how can I change this chef's table to this amazing service? And so I stumbled across projection mapping and I located a company out of Germany. It comes with five or seven courses. Uh, the guests never know what they have until the plate actually hits the table. They're actually greeted by Chef La Petite, who then gives them a demonstration about culinary history and also reveals each course. But they don't let all this fun get in the way of a fine dining experience. We wanted to give it a Miami-themed fine dining restaurant. I've always been uh, a big fan of fine dining. So with coming to Imagine a Restaurant, I wanted to create something that was really cool and cutting edge and yet memorable. This is a fabulous spread in front of me, so let's get into the menu and we'll start with the appetizers. This is their coconut almond popcorn shrimp and it comes in an old school popcorn machine. It's filled with real popcorn, of course, the fried shrimp, and it comes with two sauces, a remoulade and a Thai chili sauce. Another great way to start off your meal are with these Maryland style crab cakes. They're also topped with a remoulade sauce. Next, we have one of my favorites, the Caesar inside a Roman statue. I love the way this is presented. The romaine is grilled, so it gives it a nice charred, smoky flavor. You also have your classic Caesar dressing and plenty of Parmesan cheese. Moving on to the entrees, we're going to start with the grilled salmon, and this one is served with a very cool katana sword. The salmon is grilled, and it comes in this Thai butter sauce with a sticky rice ball covered in sesame seeds. Next, we have a Jamaican jerk southern fried chicken. So this is an airline chicken, so a chicken cut in half. It's served with a sweet potato creme brulee style side, so it has that nice sugar crust on top. Plus, it comes with a fried collard green. For you vegans and vegetarians out there, check out this veggie Napoleon. So this is stacked vegetables. You got portobello mushrooms, two different types of squash, asparagus, and this sweet potato hay on top. It also comes in a delicious pomodoro sauce. For the meat lovers, check out this ribeye steak. So it's perfectly grilled, it's marinated in garlic and herbs. It comes with a side of grilled asparagus and fingerling potatoes. For dessert, you have a couple of different options. You can get this classic carrot cake or this traditional cheesecake with this beautiful plating of raspberries and fruit paint. The projection mapping with Chef La Petite is only at their chef's table, which seats 16, and you can choose to have five or seven courses. Imaginate Restaurant is located at 401 South Lafayette in downtown Royal Oak. The ribeye. The oh, mm. ribeye. <laughs> well, if you love all things foodie related to Metro Detroit and you want restaurant recommendations and behind the scenes chats with fellow foodies, sign up for the Dine in the D newsletter. It is sent straight to your inbox every other Thursday. To sign up, look for the newsletter tab at the click, top of clickondetroit.com. And while you're online, you should join our Dine in the D group on Facebook. This way you'll always be in the know for where the best food is in Detroit. And hey, leave Mich Michelle a suggestion. You never know, she may check out your, uh, one of your favorite places.